what exactly you're doing with City. Well, I guess today to uh, let some uh, City uh, teams up to uh, do online uh, purchase for tickets and uh, you use your City credit card or City debit card uh, to purchase the tickets uh, for any single game this season uh, before they go out on sale to the public. And the, the offer is good from 10 o'clock today until 12 o'clock tomorrow night. We're just trying to promote the ticket uh, sales and uh, online uh, ticket sales for the, for the Pets and Hens City. And it's going to be various locations today, correct? Yes, yeah, so I will be here at Union Square, I will be at 42nd Street, and I will be at the Mets, uh, the Mets Square today. So I'll uh, be all around the city. Uh, we've got two other events earlier this morning, so we're just trying to get the word out. Nice. And now just talk about who you're looking forward to seeing this year for the Mets in the upcoming season. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing Johan Santana. Hopefully he bounces back from his injuries and is healthy because he can really help the staff and anchor the staff down. Uh, it's a younger staff. And when you have that veteran presence like him, a competitor, a winner, uh, it will take a lot of pressure off some of the pitchers. And how about some of the younger guys who are you looking forward to seeing back on the mound? Well, you know, obviously Dylan G had a great year last year, Jonathan Neese. And those guys hopefully will get better as they get older and uh, another year under their experience under their belt. So it'll be interesting to see Ruben Tejada uh, playing short stuff. So uh, it'll be interesting to see how things work out. And uh, being a New Yorker, how excited are you about the New York sports team right now between Linsanity and the Giants? Very happy. Uh, very happy to see that the Giants went on and won the Super Bowl, which is great for the city. Um, great, great to see Linsanity, the way it has taken off. It's, uh, Great to see the young kid get an opportunity to prove himself, and he's uh, taking the city, uh, taking the Knicks to a whole new level. The Knicks were struggling, and he came in and uh, he brought some life and energy back into that organization. So it's, it's just great to see that happen. And how excited are you just to be inducted into the Mets Hall of Fame? It's going to be. I'm very excited. I'm very honored. I'm very humbled to be, to be in the uh, Hall of Fame. Uh, growing up as a kid in New York, rooting for the Mets and being able to play for the Mets. Uh, it's a, uh, humbling and truly great honor for me to be to the And if somebody were to come up to you and just say, what's the key to longevity and success in Major League Baseball, what would you say to them? Well, it's a lot of luck, staying healthy, uh, a lot of hard work, and the off season's working out and uh, eating well. But uh, and also having some great teammates around you to help my job easier.